what is the number one thing that you need to be successful? What is it that makes the entrepreneurs, the athletes and the politicians successful? What is it that makes you successful? What is it that makes you win? Now you might give me a list of qualities to be successful, but in my opinion, there's only one quality, having passion. Now to the rest of the video, I'm going to share a quick strategy that you can use to develop passion for anything you want in your life. So here's a quick story. In 1947, there's a young boy, 17 year old boy called Roger in Harrow, England, who up to that point had never worn running spikes before. And he starts running, he starts training about three times a week and he does a mild run in four minutes, 24 seconds. Now he could have just gotten satisfied, but no, he said to himself, he can do better. He starts visualizing that he can do better and he starts looking at other runners for inspiration. So in 1949, he does a run in 4 minutes 12 seconds. In 1950, he does a run in 4 minutes 8 seconds. Now, he doesn't stop there. And here's what I want you to understand. Up to that point, in the entire human race, no one, absolutely no one, had run a mile within 4 minutes. But Roger, he thinks he can do better. And in 1954, Roger Bannister runs a mile in 3 minutes 59.4 seconds. Now what's the takeaway from that story? Why did Roger keep running? Was it because he wanted to show off? Was it because he had nothing else to do? It was because he knew he could do better. He had passion for running. And there's your strategy. The next time you want to develop passion for anything in life, say to yourself, you can do better and keep pushing those boundaries. Now, the word passion is kind of overused. People say they're passionate about they're passionate about anything, everything in their life. So the next time you want to say you're passionate about something, say to yourself, you can do better. So if you want to train, train a bit harder and you can do better. If you're in sales, engage with that customer a bit more to be better. If you're in a relationship, communicate a bit more to be better. Now here's what's happening when you say to yourself that you can do better. Psychologically, you're setting yourself up for a win. Now, here's a trick. You don't want to set unrealistic goals and say to yourself you can do better because then you'll just, uh, you're will just you just psyching yourself out. So set realistic goals, say to yourself you can do better, achieve those goals and keep pushing those boundaries and the next thing you realize, you've developed passion for that thing. So what is it that you're passionate about? What is it that you think you can do better?